What's the difference between hard and soft? Oh my God, they got some nice stuff on sale. Oh, oh. It's almost like a layaway, but you get to hold it up front. Be warned. I'm gonna tell you guys why is Black Friday approaching? If I were you, I would avoid QVC and shop HSN and shop NBC and uh, all these shop channels. Man, I'd avoid them folks like the plague, man. I'm gonna tell you why in this video. Here we go. Yeah. Tech King Mike. Once again, guys, my name is Tech King Mike. And yeah, here's the deal. This camera is $650. QVC was running a special at the time where you get it for six payments. You see it online. I think about it, debate on it, say, Mike, you ain't got $600, but you got it, but you make enough money. I'm going to drop $100 a month, you know, whatever. It's cool. It's almost like a mailway, way, but you get to hold it up front. It's actually a really good way to look at QVC, but there's a, there's a, there's a downside to it. There's a bad side to it. Here's the thing QVC. HSN, Shop NBC, all these different channels and all these different networks, websites, whatever, they're all gonna tell you the same thing. They're all gonna tell you that you can get the device or you can get the item computers, um, air fryers, cameras, uh, microphones, uh, gaming consoles, furniture, uh, clothes, food, you, food. You can get anything on a payment system, like six payments, uh, six easy pay, or six flex pay, or five flex pay, or four flex pay, or something like that. But what you're not being told not being told is that that involves a credit check yes it involves a credit check those of you out there who are going to get in the comment section you're going to thrash me for it you're going to tell me you don't know what you're talking about you don't know what you man shut up i went through it okay i went through it myself i tried to get this camera at the same time as i tried to order a computer for me and my wife both the camera and the computer were on sale six easy payments i figured we'll pay for both at the same time why not come to find out because the computer was a certain amount of money, and the camera was a certain amount of money, they ran a credit check on me. When I provided my information online, I provided no such social security number, I provided no such information or sign anything agreeing to a credit check, they just ran one. Now, initially in my mind, I'm like, I didn't give y'all permission to run my credit, but according to them, it's a soft credit check. Now folks, I'm gonna put the camera down while I do this. Y'all tell me, What's the difference between hard and soft? A hard boiled egg still tastes like a soft boiled egg, right? So when they said it was a soft credit check, in my mind, I'm like, nah, bro, that's not, that's, that's not how this is gonna work. And of course, we ended up getting approved for it because I got the camera and I got the computer as well. So, you know, at the end of the day, you might be like, well, Mike, why are you tripping about it? Why are you bugging about it? You know, just you got what you wanted. Move on from it. But here's the deal. Got to bug about it because there are people out there like myself who might want to go to QVC and buy something this year for the holidays. They may see a Black Friday deal and they may want to go purchase it for themselves or their family members that they want to find a way to buy the product now. And pretty much, like I said, they want to do layaway, but they want to have the product while they're paying on their layaway. Nothing's wrong with that. Make the payments on time, do what you're supposed to do. You got nothing to worry about, right? But what if you're somebody who is not comfortable with a credit check? My pops, my pops got A1 credit, but when somebody said they running this credit, boy, that man tight, boy, he tightened up. And you gotta, and, and it is what it is. So QVC is out here doing it. Another example, another story for you. Before I bought that computer that I bought from QVC, there was a MSI gaming laptop. I think it was the GS63VR that I saw from a website called Shop H, or not Shop H, they said Shop HQ, formerly Evine, formerly Shop NBC. For those of y'all that don't know, they've changed names three times. So keep up. The laptop was the same price on their website as it was on Amazon and as it was at Best Buy. So I'm like, Nine times out of ten, you find something on these websites, they marked up like hell. But I figured, same price, why not give it a shot, right? Slid the card digitally, made the payment, come to find out, a credit check was ran. And they declined the purchase. Now, I'm trying to figure out, why would y'all decline the purchase? You know, and ain't nothing wrong with my credit. I mean, it's rebuilding, but you know, it ain't, it ain't like it's, you know, or whatever, but it's getting up there. So I'm like, why did they decline the purchase? So I call, you know, and I'm like, hey, first and foremost, you didn't give me my money back and you didn't send me my product. So what's going on? Come to find out, because me and my wife have only been in this new address for at the time, about a month, it didn't show 
that that was our correct address on file for the credit bureaus and stuff. So because everything hadn't been updated with our credit, I got declined from being able to buy that computer. But I didn't try to buy it again. And the reason why is because when I bought that computer, or when I tried to buy the computer, I should say, again, no form, shape, way, whatever, was it listed on the website that there is a credit check that will be ran when you buy this item. All it said was five easy payments. If you're looking to buy something this, this holiday season, Black Friday, Christmas time, anything period. If you're looking online and you're looking at QVC and you see they got, oh my God, they got some nice cardigans. Oh my God, they got some nice stuff on sale. Oh, oh. If you see this stuff and you think you want to buy it for yourself, be warned that there is a possibility and a chance that they might run your credit and you might not be able to buy what you want. Just because it says easy pay don't mean it's that easy. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and leave it there. I'm just saying, be mindful of these folks. Uh, this is probably the first and last time that I plan on doing business with them because, uh, yeah, I'm straight. Uh, make sure you leave a like button, share and subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know when I post the next video. I don't know why I started doing that with my hands when I say video. It's just something about it. I just feel like I gotta just, you know, just, but anyway, so make sure you hit the like button, share the video, share it, share it, share it. Tell all your friends about it. Tell all your family members about it. Tell them that that, you know, that that tech king, he done made another video. That tech king, boy, he know he be on it. And, you know, uh, hit, you know, hit the, hit the bell notification so you know when I post my next video. And leave a comment down below. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace. Here we go. Yeah. Tech King Mike Tennis so lit Alright It's Saturday Up it's time to brawl One of these cats gotta fall Damn right It's a tech fight